Good Saturday morning. I'm meteorologist Beverly Perry, and it's certainly going to be a cold start, but luckily we're not starting in the teens this morning. We'll be in the mid to upper 20s to start the day. We'll be tucked away under the cloud cover. We may see a few hints of the sun, but notice temperatures actually heat up into the 40s. We're talking the upper 30s and low 40s this afternoon, and then it does turn a breezy on us. We'll have a northwesterly wind later on this afternoon. Gusts upwards to about 30 miles per hour, ushering in another round of Arctic air. So here Here's future tracker seeing some sunshine this morning, but the clouds they do take over for us today. Some uh, snow showers will in fact be possible from time to time throughout the day, especially for the western slopes. The rest of the viewing area anticipated to stay dry, just really breezy in the afternoon. The wind does remain strong as we progress into the evening and portions of the overnight hours. Sunday is going to be a very cold day starting things off in the teens. Sunday morning wind chills will be down near zero thanks to that wind and no major improvements are on the way to round out 2017. High temperatures are only expected to top out right in the mid 20s with afternoon wind chills in the teens. So a very cold end to 2017. Mostly cloudy today becomes breezy in the afternoon. Temperatures top out in the 30s to low 40s. Tonight it is going to be a very cold one for us. Overnight lows do fall into the teens, but when you tack on that strong wind, it's going to be feeling down near zero. High temperatures on Sunday only in the mid 20s with partly cloudy skies starting the new year with temperatures in the afternoon in the mid 20s. This could potentially be the second coldest new year on record, so definitely watching for that. 30s on the way for Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. Another punch of cold air does arrive Thursday into Friday.